Okay, hello, hello everyone. So uh, a new le a new lesson, right? So um, due to the COVID nineteen of the pandemic, so students are not be allowed in to 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 go hiking, right? So do you remember me? Yes, you should. Okay, so um today's cases we have two hundred and more. So we will restart our hiking lessons on the 9th of May. On the 9th of May, 2022. So uh, due to I have to go to Melbourne with to Australia with my whole family. So and um, I will so this is maybe the last hiking that the students would go to. So and um, also there are some reasons. So uh so uh for some some friends that told me uh some students that told me that uh his his or her legs are broken or has some any question. So and um, so this hiking trail I will not uh I will choose uh uh easiest one and will not be very harsh to do that. So it should be uh, around uh two hours or two or one one point five hours or two hours so around three to four kilometers just right so and um, you can be more chatting and just and don't just do more and just walk hiking and take photos okay so um today I will assign this homework to do so let me introduce what is this homework is about so this homework is called zero one Mary House Trail Session Six. So you should walk your hiking trail in typo road, typo road, typo road, which means um you can search is typo road. Typo road is in the is in Hong Kong in in uh Kowloon and Shamshe Po. So um this road will, will cross to uh Kem Shan, Kem Shan. So do you know where is Kem Shan? So Kem Shan is a mountain in Hong Kong. We have a lot of monkeys. Okay. So uh, Mary House Trail Session Six. So you and I will introduce this one. So in this trail, um, uh, this trail. Okay. So in wow. Okay, so in this trail, so uh, the trail summary, the length is 4.6 kilometers. So uh, it's okay, I've already told that, four to five kilometers. So the duration is 1.5 hours. The region is in the central new territory. So uh, from uh, later, I will show you the map of this set of this many house trail. So in this many house trail, um, we call it many, ha many house trail session six. So let me introduce our many house trail. So many house trail is the trail that is can be a pretty good family to walk. It is a good route for everyone. Uh, but there are some trails such as session eight. Session eight, nine, ten would be a little bit difficult for the fam for families. So. Uh, I would suggest if I'm a, I, I'm a hiking teacher, so I would suggest you should walk session one to session six or anyone because a many house trail has the length is 100 kilometers. Uh, the session one is from the Park Tam Shou and session 10 is go to Tu Moon. So uh, if you can walk the whole many house trail, so congratulations. But yeah, uh, but uh, uh, according to the fast record, uh, it should be you have to lose about one, uh, one week or two weeks to do that. Uh, because you should, uh, if you uh go hiking, so you can try to go it by at night. So you should bring the uh the torch or other lighting things to do that. Okay, so uh, let, uh, uh, let me tell you about session six. So the sixth session is the shortest and the easiest of the Mary House trail. It is therefore quite popular among novice hikers. So novice hiker, which means that you are a new, you, you don't have any hiking experience and you have a little bit hiking experience. So you are north hikers. So uh, north hikers, you, if you are north hikers, so this trail must be suitable for you. Um, so living from Taipo Road, first thing, uh, so the, uh, 
the southern point is in the Shetley Pool Reservoir. So it's a time from road between Shetley Pool Reservoir. So uh, you can walk to the uh, Camp Sham Road and walk from the Camp Sham Road. And this uh, uh, a little bit is the is the road, is the main road. So uh, be careful of the vehicles, okay? So uh, uh, for Shingmo Reservoir, so VIA, Kalu Reservoir. So in this chart, you will see two reservoirs. Number one is the Shingmo Reservoir. Number two is the Kalu Reservoir. So uh, you will see macules, macules roaming in groups on the way. So you can see that the Shingmo Reservoir, Shingmo Reservoir, macules. So I'll give you some... So give you some hints. So this one, you will see a lot of oh, monkeys or macules. So uh, a, a lot of that in Kamshan. So in Kamshan, we are also trained macules, macules, ha, macules here, okay? Or you can see Kamshan also, okay. So roaming groups in the way. So you should, if you have bring the, the snacks or some food, please don't take it out, okay? Please don't take it out because the macules will stolen will stole your food okay so it's very very dangerous okay so let's uh give you to watch a video so you can see that it is very serious in hong kong so give you more uh more knowledge wait a minute i've opened the video first okay so let's see. So it's Cantonese. So this is from the uh, TVB, uh, TVB program school. So you can see that. So it is in the 2018. So this is in the Kamshan. So it's type of road. So this is the first stop. So you can see that this is the right back. So the 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 monkeys were st uh, a, a stone. The, the snacks. You can see that. So we play it. So you can see that it's eating, it's eating, right? So you can see that someone is printing the monkeys. Okay, so I will stop it here. So let us go back to our hiking trail. Okay, so the monkeys we can see now are the death rods of the ones previously introduced in Hong Kong with the field of encouraging the safety of fresh water by having them eaten poisonous plants as grown up plants. So you can add this uh, introduction of the Kalu Reservoir. So Kalu Reservoir was built in the 1920s and the cluster of the reservoirs compressed Kalu Reservoir. Kalu Beach was a, a bit by Washer Reservoir, Kowloon Reception Reservoir, and Shetley Pre Reservoir. So, uh, Kowloon Reservoir, you can divide it to three parts. I repeat one once again. The one is the is the compressed Kowloon Reservoir. Number two is the Kowloon by Wash Reservoir. Number three is the Kowloon Reception Reservoir, and Shetley Pre Reservoir is the another reservoir. Okay. So, uh, in each of the reservoir, they have a main dam. Main dam. So the main dam is the is an another recorder house house are all declared moments in Hong Kong. The ma magnificent dam and the encouraged message make this session particularly public compared with other sessions. So give uh give you some photos so you can see the rest of what was beautiful. Okay, so you can take photos of the magnificent rings. So uh, let me give you a map here to see it. Also, I've all, uh, also posted the map onto the Google Classroom so you can refer it or look at my this video. Wait a minute. Oh, 
post now. And later, I will upload this video to the Google Classroom so you can refer it. Okay. So tell me if you have any problems. Okay, so this is the Google, this is the map. So you can see that is the, this is, this is the starting point. You can see that. The starting point. Okay. Starting point is here. So you uh, VIA, the column, they was reservoir, Shatley Pool Reservoir, and Cape Sprite Walking. Right walking to the freighting range, and you can see that this is the Shenmue Spongeer Range, Spongeer Range, Ma Zi Gang, okay, Spongeer Range, and then you can keep going, keep going, and then it is the end point in the same Shenmue Reservoir. So if you have time, you can also go to the Shenmue Reservoir to to take some photos or see the magnificent rooms if you have time, okay. So uh, let me uh. Uh, tell you about the transportation information. So any question about the hiking routes? So uh, number one, so starting point, you should take the public transport to Shetley Pool Reservoir bus stop. So the Kowloon bus route 72 at 81. So 72, so where you can find this bus route, just Google it. So Google it, you can find this uh, bus, this bus would be from Taipo, Tai Tai World, and Changsha One. So if you are uh, uh, live in the new territories, if you are new, new, live in the new territories, you can go to Changsha One to take these buses. Or, or if you are live, or if you are living in Taipo, you can also take these buses. So remember, you should uh, advise, advise, at Shat Lei Pui bus stop, Shat Lei Pui Reservoir bus stop, okay? Shat Lei Pui Reservoir bus stop. Here, can you see that? So not Kowloon Reservoir, it's Shat Lei Pui Reservoir, okay? So uh, if you are lived in Sha Tin or something, so you can also choose 81 bus road, 81, 81. So 81, uh, you can find it in the uh, Jordan of the, of the West Carlin Station or the Austin Station, or you can you can take this bus at War Chair, which place in the Sha Tin, okay? Sha Tin, Sha Tin Park Central is also okay. Understand? So, oh, if uh, if you say, oh, Mister Ao, I live in Hong Kong Island, so how can I do? Okay, so uh, you should choose. You should take the MTR. Wait a minute. So uh, you should take the MTR. So if you are live in Hong Kong Island, so you can take the MTR, go to Admiralty and change to Shun One Line. You can change to Shun One Line and go to Prince Edward Station. Prince Edward Station. Arrive at Prince Edward Station. So uh, in you can uh. Take the bus 81, 81, okay? So uh, 81, the big, uh, I will introduce, uh, I will later, I will talk about 72 and 81 bus for their differences. So let me, uh, you can also, uh, in this uh, Prince Edward station here. So uh, this one in is on the N75 platform, N75 platform. So um, this is in of the, uh, uh, it is uh, nearby the Wong, uh, Mong Kok police station. So you can walk to this and you can see that there is a bus stop here and you can take uh, 81 buses uh, and you can take 81 bus. So, uh, now I will introduce 72 and 81 bus, the difference between them. So 72 bus, you can see that uh, it is the route is 24.7 kilometers, but you can see that the, uh, the bus route is about uh, 15 to 30 minutes per one. So it's very straight, right? It's, it's very sparse. Also, the bouncy. Okay, so you can see that. So, uh, I would prefer you you choose eighty one. Eighty one because you can see that, and uh, it's strong. It's about ten to twenty minutes. It is will be a, a, a 
this has been good, right? So, uh, any question about the hiking routes? So, uh, I play this video to you. And you can see that the magnificent view. you can see the Biken Hill, also Tai Bo Shan, or the Kowloon Bible Festival, okay? So uh, the photos you do it by yourself, so I don't waste time. So uh, I've already talked about a lot of things. So do you remember it or do you have any question? So I thought a lot of things. Is there any homework you asked? Yes, there is a homework you need to do. Okay, so when you finish your hiking on the 9th of May, on the 9th of May, so uh, I will give you about a week so you should complete it uh, before the 17th of May, okay? Before the 17th of May, this homework. So you should complete worship one before 17th of May. So what is worship one? So now I will show you again. So you can see that I uh, open the Google Classroom, you can see that there is a worship one here. So you should print it out or uh, or use a piece of A4 size paper to do this. So write, uh, write your name, class, and class number in the days of today. So this homework will is 40 points. So it will be your second term, a piece of the first homework of second term. So uh, question one. So you should use 250 words or above to introduce today's hiking trip. So this 12 months. So I've already given you a lot of guidance. So when did you when did you go there? So when did you go there? So when did you go there? So how did you get there? So who did you go with? What did you do there? It's beautiful wheels, take some photos. How do you feel? Talk about your lunch. Is something where feelings anything happened? So you can see there's some hiking experience. So this is your hiking introduced us. So you have something happened, right? And what do you learn in this hiking trip? So what do you learn? Name or two or three, three reasons. What did you learn and why? So tips number one, you should use the past tense. Number two, check your spelling before you hang in your work. Number three, please upload your work to Google Classroom. Change it to a PDF format. Format. Two marks will be deducted if students take photos and upload it to Google Classroom. Do not take photos. And next submit, and next submitters will have marks deducted also. Okay. So this is should not be twelve marks. It should be for forty marks. So just this is your homework. This is your worship one. Okay. So print it out and do it for a week. You have uh, one week time, okay? So it, it will be count as content, language, organization, and format. And the total mark is 40. Total mark is 40. So 250 words or above. So do not write, uh, do write about 250 words or 300 is also okay. So do not write 100 words, okay? Or no marks will be given. Any problem? So if not, um, the rest of the time, I will give you to, uh, to take a look at some photos. So what, what is this? What is this? Can anyone tell me what is this? So give you about five seconds to, uh, one minute to think about what, what is it. Okay. One moment, one minute to think, to think about it. What is it? 
what I said. Think about that. What is it? Can you tell me what is this animal? So, 18 seconds. So, oh, uh, that. I know that then. So, time is up. So, can anyone tell me? Okay, can anyone tell me? What is it? So it's a boar, B O A R, boar, okay? Boar. So do you know how to spell it? Boar. 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 Boar, okay? It's a boar. And it's a yeju, Chinese yeju, okay? Boar. And then, so let's see some photos. So this is the next photo. So this is the exit. An exit point for the exit point. Oh, I've a uh, uh, transportation for the exit. I haven't talked about that. So for the exit point, what you should do? So you can take the Great Valley Bus Road number eighty two at the Pontypool Dam of the Shimu Reservoir to Chimwen. Or if you see that uh the minibus was uh, was crowded, so you can also continue to walk for twenty minutes to Hawthorne College bus stop at Warney Head Road and take public transport to leave. So there are thirty two, forty six, forty x, forty six p, forty seven x, forty eight x, seventy three x, two seven eight eight x. And for these things, 40p, 46p, 47a, 234c, 273c, 273p, and 278p. So great many bus, you can have 94, 312, 403, 403a, 403x, and 94s. So 94s, remember, is only runs on Sunday and plug black holidays. Okay? So for more information, you can refer to the Hong Kong W uh, helps www.hk and modernty.government.hk or refer to the hiking.gov.hk. So also I have a new app that you can download. It's called Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Watch HK, this one. So it is a good for see the hiking. Okay. So you can download it in your Google Play or in the App Store. So, any question about this hiking? So remember, do not uh, press the deadline. So do not miss the deadline. So the deadline, I, re I, I repeat it once again. So it should be on the uh, 17th of May. It is on Tuesday. So any question? If not, I will upload this video to Google Classroom and assign this homework to you guys. So and after on the 10th of May, I will be seeing you at school. So if you uh uh I will give you a sorry, uh no 17 is very long. So I'll give you on 12, 12, okay, 12. I know 17. So please complete it and do not miss it and be punctual, okay? So uh, this is the end of today's video. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. Bye-bye.